6 Unexpected Things That Can Bring a Girl to Orgasm 1. Exercise Many admit that during and after training they experience incredible pleasure. But some athletes are especially lucky. Corgasm, why it happens, how to have one, and more slash health line, from the English core, muscle corset and orgasm, actually, orgasm, is the name given to spontaneous orgasms caused by physical exertion. Corgasms are regularly recorded in women and extremely rarely in men. Scientists have not yet figured out the reasons for such injustice, as, indeed, with the very nature of corgasms. Tight, tired abdominal and pelvic muscles are supposed to produce micro-vibrations that stimulate the pelvic floor and clitoris. If this stimulation is combined with the right emotional background and anatomy, the woman experiences corgasm, a sensation similar to a deep vaginal orgasm, but thankfully not as intense. Imagine a real orgasm somewhere on the simulator in the public hall. Yes, here is a list of exercises that most often lead to corgasm. Squats. Pull UPS. Twisting, turning the torso relative to the legs. Various plank options. Exercises related to knee and hip lifts. Rope climbs. Some positions from yoga are mainly those that are associated with the load on the press. Enjoy. 2. Childbirth. Orgasm during contractions is a phenomenon, albeit not very common, but it really exists. A few years ago, scientists interviewed T. Postel. Childbirth climax, the revealing of obstetrical orgasm slash sexologies by almost 1,000 French midwives who attended about 200,000 births. As it turned out, 668 mothers themselves told doctors that they were experiencing sensations similar to orgasm. In 868 cases, midwives observed signs of pleasure in their patients. In another nine cases, women in labor directly stated, during childbirth, they experienced the same peak of sexual pleasure as in bed with their beloved men. The number of such lucky women is generally small, and orgasm is observed in about 0.3% of births. However, there are more optimistic statistics. Thus, a survey of 6% of women have an orgasm during birth slash the health site.com, conducted by the American Movement for Positive Birth and Channel Mum, showed that about 6% of mothers report sexual pleasure during childbirth. 3. Yawning. Not simple, but against the background of taking antidepressants. In general, most of the drugs with which it is customary to fight depression do not have a very good effect on sexual life. As a rule, they sharply reduce libido. However, there are also exceptions. In about 5% of patients, taking popular antidepressants causes a curious phenomenon, a prolonged yawn, during which a real orgasm rolls over them. The yawning orgasm and other antidepressant side effects slash Fox News Norman Sussman is a clinical professor of psychology at the New York University School of Medicine. Note that this trigger for spontaneous orgasm is also available to men. For taking medication for Parkinson's disease. In the history of medical observations, there is a case of a 42-year-old patient who, after seven days of taking the drug, began to complain of woman's spontaneous orgasms triggered by Parkinson's drug slash live science to doctors about intense spontaneous orgasms. The woman experienced from 3 to 5 sudden orgasms daily, and each of them lasted from 5 to 20 seconds. Doctors decided to temporarily cancel the drug with such a strange side effect. After 15 calm days, the patient began taking the medicine again, and spontaneous orgasms returned. As a result, the woman refused to take a particular remedy forever. Scientists have not yet figured out what caused this effect. It is only assumed that the drugs dramatically change the level of dopamine, the hormone that is responsible for the emergence of pleasure. 5. Walking Also not common, but a case recorded by science. One day, a 55-year-old woman from the Netherlands went to the doctor with a strange complaint, when walking, she got up to six orgasms a day. The growing sensation began in her left foot, gradually rising through her knee to her pelvis. 
the patient herself was not at all pleased with the situation, since spontaneous orgasms were absolutely not connected with her plans, thoughts, and moods. MRI scans of the brain and legs showed no abnormalities. But when the doctors gave the woman an anesthetic injection into the spinal nerve that received sensory information from the foot, the bouts of sudden sexual pleasures ended. The same incident entered M.D. Waldinger, G.J. DeLint, et al. Foot Orgasm Syndrome, a case report in a woman slash the Journal of Sexual Medicine in the History of Medicine called Foot Orgasm Syndrome. Six Fantasies A rich imagination is another way to get an orgasm even in the most inappropriate situations for this. Sexologists from Rutgers University, USA, found 11 women aged 29 to 74 who claimed to be able to experience